Dr. Hugh Gordon Roberts Hospital in Shillong launched its first online consultation platform on Thursday, August 12, in collaboration with InTown Solution in telemedicine online consultation platform via a portal called intownhealth.in. It is the second hospital in Shillong to do so after Negrim's Hospital. Speaking to media persons, KW Marbanyang, the administrative officer of Dr. H.G. Roberts Hospital said, since the people have been apprehensive to come to the hospital, an online consultation platform would to some extent solve the problem for most patients. See the reports from the government, from the district administration, you'll find it's mostly because of the late report to the hospital. It comes only after they started starting treatment at home only. When it is a situation which they cannot no longer decide, then you will come to report the hospital, but that time is too late, and that's why the eventuality occurs. But the system has helped us in quite a way a lot, especially as Dr. Meban has said. Mainly it will be in the urban context, in the urban areas, because as you know the, te the telecommunication, the connectivity of the uh, uh, internet and so on and so forth will be primarily in the urban. But in case if the in the rural, also, as Dr. has suggested, if there is a connectivity, that facility will always be open. And you know, if you see, I've seen the report, government also on the 7th of May, I remember precisely, had given one order that all the private hospitals also should start, uh, you know, roll out this telecommunication, uh, telemedicine uh, consultation services for the benefit of the patient, especially during this pandemic, uh, pandemic period. Because this um, telemedicine con uh, consultation service, it uh, eliminates the possibility of transmitting the infectious diseases between the patients and the health professionals. That is one of the advantages. And number two is that all consultation, even prescriptions, medications and all this can be done online. So that is the advantage. You reduce not only the time of consultation, you reduce even the transportation cost, you reduce even out of pocket space completely reduced. So that is the main advantage of this telemedicine control services. It may be mentioned that a patient who intends to book an appointment online would need to sign up or register on the website and upload their documents or reports if required for the doctors to see. The helpline number has also been created to connect calls to the doctors and payments can also be made online. Application, uh, how to apply the telemedicine portal will actually depend on how, how uh, means it depends on person to person and how you try to use technology to your advantage. But to say that, okay, I, I am having a heart attack, please manage by telemedicine, I think the law of the land does not even allow that. Okay, So there are certain things that we doctors have been trained, that we are allowed by the law of the government of India to say that certain drugs we can prescribe, certain, uh, not all drugs can be can't, uh, can be prescribed. There are so many things, but I guess that is that we will take a call with the patients when we uh, talk to them. Back to our hospital. But through this teleconference uh, that we are launching, that one aspect we will tackle, that we will also be able to assess our uh, patients, whoever is calling us, we will assess properly. And if there is a need, we will surely advise to come to the hospital as soon as possible, not to just stay at home and take our medicines. And uh, I think this will help because if uh, any patients uh, hear from uh, their doctor's mouth, asking them to come to the hospital, they will be there for them. I think that will uh, that will help a lot to convince them that okay, my doctor has asked me to come to the hospital. It should be safer than me uh, for me there than at home. The consultation services provided by the hospital through this portal are general medicine, surgery, pediatrics, orthopedics, pediatric surgery, emergency medicine, and COVID telemedicine. TNT Bureau.